Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Kung sa mga bagong viewers ko dyan, hello sa inyong lahat. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and yung bell na button beside it para ma-notify kayo every time na may bago akong uploads. And today, I'll be doing a review, swatches, and tutorial with this new Androgyny palette from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. If you wanna know my thoughts about this eyeshadow palette, please keep on watching. Okay, so let's begin with the makeup tutorial and kagamit ako ulit ng tape. Pero naalala ko na meron pala akong shadow shields um, na nabili ko from Morphe nung una nagpunta ako sa store nila. So, um, I'm gonna use it today. And pahinga muna yung tape ko. This is the first time that I'm going to use this shadow shield. Kaya sana... Oh, madami pala siya. Uh, hindi ko lang kung gano'n siya kadami pero... Kuha tayo ng dalawa. And paano ba ito gamitin? Nakita ko si Sis Jamie na gumagamit nito pero hindi ko kung paano siya gamitin. Let's see. So, I think okay na siya and sana pantay siya mamaya pag tinanggal ko and I'm so excited to use this palette. Grabe, hindi ko pa siya sinwatch. Pinicturean ko lang siya para ipost sa aking social media accounts pero hindi ko pa siya sinwatch. So, ngayon pa lang but um, gagawin muna tayo ng tutorial. Mamaya ko siya isiswatch sa kamay ko. So, let's begin. Um, hindi ako naglagay ng eye primer sa mata ko pero sinet ko siya ng powder. Yung aking Fit Me, yung Maybelline Fit Me na powder. So, ayan siya and hindi ko pa alam kung anong gagawin kong makeup look guys. So, first, let's start with a transition shade and ang gagamitin ko is itong um, safe word and I'm going to use it with my Morphe M200 na brush. Next shade na gagamitin natin for crease is itong shade na Charm. Um, so, medyo orange yung shade niya. So, let's see kung maganda siya for my crease color today. So, ang ginagawa ko para makita ko yung crease ko, um, tumitingala lang ako ng onte Tapos, there. So, I'm going back and forth with my um, blending brush after kong ilagay sa crease color itong shade na Charm. Para lang, ano, uh, ma-blend lang natin ng maayos and walang harsh lines. Next, for our lead color, I'm going to use this blue shade and ang name niya is Swallow. I'm going to use it with my M167. So, ayan na siya. And I'm going back with my Morphe 167 na brush para i-blend i <laughs> i lang yung blue at saka yung um, charm na shade kanina. So, first na napansin ko is itong shade niya na swallow. Itong blue niya na shade is mahirap i-blend. Mahirap din ilagay sa aking lead color. Hindi ko lang kung dahil sa brush ko. Pero, yun. Yun lang inapansin ko. Kailangan ko siyang re-apply ng ilang beses. Siguro kasi guys, hindi ako gumamit ng eyeshadow primer. Kaya nahirapan ako. Pero, yun lang naman yung napansin ko. So, next na ginawa ko, naglagay ako ng um, inner corner na highlight using the shade Frosting. Dahil yung palette na to, wala siyang um, parang magandang brow bow na highlight. So, I'm going to use the Morphe Kathleen Lights palette. Yung bone color na shade para lang linisin yung aking brow bone. So, let's start first with the packaging. Yung packaging niya is sobrang elegant for me. You know, para sa akin, everything na merong gold na packaging or silver na packaging, it looks elegant para sa akin. So, hindi ko alam kung ganun yung sa inyo. But it comes with this um, packaging. And, ganito naman yung itsura niya sa likod. It says here, 10 jaw-dropping shades. It's vegan. It's also cruelty-free. It is long-lasting, buttery, and delicious. And, it says here na ito daw yung version nila of a neutral palette. Now, let's move on dun sa packaging ng mismong eyeshadow palette na sobrang 
Actually, ako, hindi ako fan ng kahit na anong reptile. Actually, I'm scared of snakes and sobrang laki ng fear ko pagdating sa mga ahas. <laughs> Kaya nang bahala kung paano ni interpret yun. But, itong packaging na to, um, it's um, ano ba to? Parang reptile. Actually, para siyang crocodile. Yung skin niya, parang ganun. Pero hindi mo siya at the point na talaga nakakatakot na packaging. And ganito yung itsura niya. So, I bought this palette from beautylish.com. Hindi ko siya in-order dun sa mismong website ni Jeffree Star because matagal yung shipping nila. So, uh, when I ordered my, um, yung kanyang holiday na Velour Liquid Lipstick, parang dumating sa akin after two weeks and nandito lang naman ako sa San Diego which is part din ng California kung saan gawa itong mga cosmetics na to so tinanong ko si Sis Kears kung kamusta ba yung um, shipping sa beauty leash and sabi niya sobrang bilis nga so dun lang ako nag-order and I bought this for $45 not including yung tax but I would say with the price na $45 sulit na sulit siya guys so I will show you a picture ng loob so let's begin with the swatches First, I have here the shade Frosting, and this is a metallic gold. Next is Safe Word. This is a cool toned light brown. Next is Charm, which is this orangey shade. Next is Deja Vu, and this is a frosted metallic brown. Next is Dominatrix, so itong shade na to is the same shade nung kanyang liquid lipstick. Next is Androgyny. This is described as a mauve plum na shade. Next is Fetish, which is a deep dark red uh, with a little sparkle. Next is Military, and this is um, a military green. Next is Poison, which is a teal green. And last is Swallow, which is a dark blue shade. So, hindi na ako magpapaligoy-ligoy, guys. Kasabihin ko na sa inyo na sobrang maganda tong eyeshadow palette na to sobrang pigmented niya isang swatch lang is sobrang may kita mo na kaagad yung color payoff niya another thing na maganda dito sa palette na to is sobrang laki nung kanyang mga sizes yung pan ng kanyang eyeshadow is sobrang laki and I think maglalasto for years and years sa inyo at isa pang maganda dito sa palette na to is meron siyang kasamang mirror which is perfect for traveling very lightweight lang din itong eyeshadow palette na to hindi siya mabigat and guys, inamoy ko din tong eyeshadow palette na to. And wala siyang nasty smell or yung mabahong amoy kagaya ng mga eyeshadow palette ni Kylie. And kung tatanangin niyo ako kung ano yung mas gusto ko, kung itong palette na to or yung kanyang Royal Peach palette, ito yung mas gusto ko guys. Hindi ako nagsisinungaling, mas bet ko talaga tong eyeshadow palette na to. So let me know in the comments down below kung gusto niyo pa makakita ng mga makeup look using this um, eyeshadow palette dahil from now on, ito na yung gagamitin kong eyeshadow palette everyday kasi hindi ko pa nga nagagamit lahat ng shades na to. Thank you for watching guys and I'll see you in my next video.